about that. We were discussing loose morals. He never made a formal complaint. But if the incident were somehow to become widely known now under these sad circumstances, what circumstances? You haven't heard. Dorian Crane died within minutes of being stabbed through the heart. I'd say the killer held the sword against him when Dorian was in a standing position before pushing it home with a single thrust. Alice was covered in blood. Well, it's consistent with finding him and cradling him in her arms. Miss Lund managed to question her. She had to be sedated. Are you getting anywhere with this case? Yes, thanks, Sergeant. For a start, we think that Alice was meant to be the first victim, not Marina. Let's do with the mirror. I mean, Alice and Alice through the looking glass. Now you've got the sword from the Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. What next? Body killing big ears? Oh, incidentally, one of my students was looking at the post mortem photographs. That piece of jewelry she wore was a Taoese locket, apparently. It's an Islamic thing. She was a Muslim. Aren't there any Muslims in the Czech Republic? Well, not as many, I imagine, as there are in other countries. She was nervous over immigration status. Stop. Tell me she keep her options open. We don't know for certain that Marina was mistaken for Alice, however special the perfume was. I want to have a word with Marina's friend, what's her name? Layla Adan. Enough, if you want. People compared Dorian to C.S. Lewis. But then Lewis was some pushing 40 before he had success as a writer. The allegory of love. Did you know it? Not offhand, no. Well, he was very perceptive about the subject. For a man who'd yet to know love. Well, at least Dorian had known love, didn't he? Have you contacted your husband? Oh. Tell him. Oh, makes not Dorian's father. We fostered him. Oh, I see. We couldn't have kids. It was about adopting, and then the fostering thing came up. We took Dorian. He was ten. And he stayed. In the first month, he insisted he was an orphan prince. <laughs> but then he grew up. Where is Nick man? Oh, Lord knows. I walked out 11 years ago, Dorian's 15th birthday. It's wrong. He's wrong. Left me high and dry. There was something taken from Dorian's room last night, a decorated box from the shelf. Oh, I gave that to him. I did in the junk shop the year he went up to Oxford. Any idea what he kept it? It's an end, I suppose. Personal bits and pieces. <sighs> yeah, he had an extraordinary talent. Have you, um, read Boxland? Just a bit of a chapter about a magical mirror? Oh, I know it's not the sort of thing, Robbie, but... 